Hey guys, so we are going to the Colorado RV show. We pulled our son out of school today, so he's going to have a half day. And we are going to head out and go play today. show um we got our dji with us we might go fly it over there we might it's my mom and dad's choice so i can't wait to show the dji dji camera footage for dakota's awesome adventures So I really like this momentum toy hauler that we popped into. A um, couple of really fun, cool things that I am totally digging about this. First of all, the garage area is great and it has like this nice patio that um, you can just put pack your furniture on or, or put your toys on or whatever. Um, the other thing that is so cool is there is this bunk up here and then that we up, up in drops the kitchen. down. So you've got this extra bunk for sleeping space that's up whoa, here. Whoa. And then there's a half bathroom just right back here. So a little half bath here, little tight quarters, but hey, it's an extra bathroom. And then there's a full bathroom up front. So let me show you the front because this is also pretty cool up here. So back here, this is really cool. This is your main kind of living area. Um, you walk in and it's very, very spacious, especially with this whole slide out and very high ceilings. But get this, I walked into the space with the high ceilings and momentum is not wasting any space because take a look at this. Right up here, you've got a whole nother bunk. So there's a ladder you can climb and the bunk goes all the way back there. Hi, so if you've got a kiddo that just kind of likes their privacy or even a grown-up that likes their privacy, you could just put them on the bunk up there at the top. So very nice kitchen. Look at these cabinets. These cabinets, I love these because they are so nice and tall. Now, I'm a pretty tall person, so I can definitely reach this space with no problem. If you're a little bit shorter, you might need to get some sort of a little step stool, but I love the tall cabinets, lots of cabinet space in this kitchen area, digging this pantry um, for food and things like that. Total great use of space inside of this particular unit. So totally digging all of the storage, all of the space that's in here. And then let's go check out the bedroom. Fire! So back here, we've got the bedroom and the bathroom. This main bathroom is definitely a little bit more spacious. So you've got your shower with the shower curtain that kind of pops out, which is so nice because then you don't feel like that the shower curtain is going to start sticking to your body when you're in the shower. Um, plenty of room here. Lots of elbow space um here where this toilet is and the bathroom's very spacious and then i was checking out this cabinet here this is really deep so you've got a lot of space here for blankets or pillows or whatever that you might would want to stick in there and then let's take a look at the bedroom so bedroom is super comfortable um i don't even know if you can hear but there's a sound difference even right now, me standing back here versus up there where everything's very nice and insulated and just extremely, extremely quiet back here in this bedroom area. You can get either a queen or a king bed. It has either option. So that's kind of a nice thing too if you prefer that king size bed and you need that little bit extra space. So overall, super, super impressed with this particular fifth wheel.
really good RV. I, I like the T. I like the TV. As soon as you lay down, it's like you're laying. It's like you're laying on a super soft blanket. So I like this. This is so nice. So let's go check out some more RVs. All right.